Tough Chicks, written by C.C. Mang, illustrated by Melissa Suber. From the moment Mama Hen's eggs burst open, she knew she was dealing with some pretty tough chicks. Penny, Polly, and Molly shook out their wet fluff and immediately began to strut around the farm. Peep, peep, zoom, zip, cheep. They wrestled the worms, they raced the bugs, they dove off the fence after the pesky barn flies. Make them be good, clucked the hens in the hen house. Mama Hen ruffled her feathers. They are good, she replied, though at times the chicks did make trouble. Peep, peep, zoom, zip, cheep. Penny liked to grab the cow's tail to hitch a ride. Polly was fond of rooster roping. And Molly was partial to mud, lots of mud. She loved a good roll in the pig pen. Make them be good, called the animals. They are good, Mama Hen clucked. But sometimes even she worried. Like the time Farmer Fred found the chicks looking under the hood of his tractor. We didn't touch anything. We just wanted to see how it worked, peeped Penny, Polly, and Molly. Make them be good, grumbled the farmer. Chicks don't belong in tractors. Mama Hen looked at the other chicks. Some were preening their first feathers under the morning sun. Others were quietly pecking grain from the hen house floor. Two were hiding under their mama's wing, afraid to come out. My chicks are different, all right, thought Mama Hen, but they're tough and they're smart and they're different in a good way. Peep, peep, zoom, zip, cheep. Watch out below, Penny hollered as she swung off the cow's tail and into the yard. The other chicks ran for cover. Careful, Mama Hen called to Penny. Nice form, she added quietly. The hens in the hen house decided it was time to teach Penny, Polly, and Molly how to behave like proper chickens. They tried to show the chicks the fine art of scratching for grain. Not a speck of grain was found. The rooster tried showing the chicks how to cluck in a calm and collected manner. Not a proper cluck was heard. The pigs even demonstrated how to make a nest. Not a single nest was built. When Farmer Fred found the chicks looking under the hood of his tractor again, it was the last straw. He leaned forward and fixed the chicks with a stern eye. You are little fuzzy headed chicks. Be cute, be quiet, be good, and stay away from my tractor. I have hay to move before the rain comes. The chicks watched from the yard as Farmer Fred drove the tractor around the field, gathering the hay. But on his way back to the barn, the tractor spit out a puff of black smoke, gave a loud clunk, then a long screech, and came to a sudden stop. Farmer Fred looked under the hood. He looked up at the dark clouds. He looked worried. Then he walked to the back of the tractor and gave it a mighty push. The tractor began to roll. Faster and faster it rolled down the hill. It was heading straight for the hen house. Bad idea, bleated the sheep. Move, bellowed the cow. What are we going to do, crowed the rooster. While the rest of the animals ran for safety, Penny, Polly, and Molly sprang into action. Peep, peep, zoom, zip, cheep. They swung off the cow's tail and onto the tractor's steering wheel, turning the tractor in the nick of time. The hen house was saved, but the tractor came to a stop smack in the middle of the pig's favorite mud hole. Mama Hen rounded up her chicks. I think it's time we showed these animals how good it is to have tough, smart chicks around. 
the chicks quickly scratched out a plan and the animals went to work. Under the hood of the tractor, the chicks tightened belts, checked fluids, and patched a few holes with Molly's super strong mud mixture. When they were done, Farmer Fred started his tractor. It worked! The animals cheered! Those are some tough chicks, the animals said. I know, said Mama Hen. Farmer Fred stopped his tractor. Those are some smart chicks, he said. I know, said Mama Hen. She turned to Penny, Polly, and Molly and gave them each a peck on the cheek. These are some good chicks, said Mama Hen. We know, said Penny, Polly, and Molly. Peep, peep, zoom, zip, cheep. 